Hello, I am uh, Raffaella Buonsanti, an associate professor and aide of the Laboratory of Nanochemistry here at EPFL. Today is our pleasure to introduce you our recent contribution published in the Journal of the American Chemical Society, uh, which is about the synthesis of photoactive ligand nanocrystal composite materials using colloidal atomic layer deposition, which is a methodology recently developed by our group. Colloidal atomic layer deposition enables the growth of oxide shells around nanocrystal. This method is performed through alternating additions of highly reactive metal precursor and oxygen in a flask containing the nanocrystals. The number of cycles tunes the thickness of the oxide shell. To preserve colloidal stability, we add ligands after a certain number of cycles. This addition is the key to our results. So here we have a typical working colloidal setup. We will emitted a 380 gram quantum flask with the perovskite suspension connected to a nitrogen filled shrink line. On the left, we have the TMA syringe currently dispersing a fixed amount of TMA to grow an alumina shell thanks to a syringe pump. And then on the right, we have a mass flow controller allowing us to inject oxygen. We repeat a couple of times those cycles and then we add the ligands to finalize our shell. NMR experiments reveal that precursor ligand interactions are crucial to initiate the growth of the shells. Furthermore, we found that the ligands are integral components of the shell and not simply there to preserve colloidal stability. Thus, we sought to leverage this unique feature of our shells to introduce ligands with functionalities additional to those of the nanocrystals and create new organic and inorganic composite materials. In this manuscript, we use colloidal ALD as a method to spatially control a tunable density of photoactive ligands around a variety of semiconductor nanocrystals. We demonstrated the assembly of structures capable of funneling the energy provided by photoexcitation of the nanocrystals through the ligands away from the nanocrystal core when the energetics of the systems are properly chosen. Such a structure is difficult to replicate via conventional approaches such as ligand exchange procedures. Overall, we showed that colloidal ALD enables the synthesis of organic and inorganic composite materials capable of directing the flow of energy while endowing enhanced stability to the nanocrystal core. These materials can be applied in incoherent photon conversion and photocatalysis. We also envisioned that our scheme could be used to incorporate other functional ligands for applications ranging from sensing to electrocatalysis.